Yo, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Les, and I'm back with another one, man. This video is called Indonesia Make Us Feel Alive. You know what I mean? Without further ado, if you're new to the channel, like always, what I'm gonna smash a like and subscribe. You feel me? I really appreciate it, man. Let's make the channel grow together. Let's make the channel grow together, man. You know what I mean? Let's make this fan base grow together. You feel me? So, without further ado, let's get to the video. You ready? I'm ready. Let's get to it. Where do I begin? Oh, the beat. The doom. Instantly. Indonesia felt like a place we had been to many times before. Just not in a waking state. As fantastical as this might sound, what that, we that's some scary stuff right there. Quite literally, the stuff dreams are made of. <laughs> you guys experience this every day, or once in a while. That's incredible that you guys live there. You know what I mean? You can get up. You know what I mean? Hop in your car. Let's take a hike. Let's go somewhere. Let's see something. You feel me? And me, I got like a computer to see this shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's insane. Indonesia is so vast. Wow. That it's difficult to bundle it under the umbrella of just one country. With its some 18,000 islands, there are entire worlds waiting to be discovered. Wow. The exploration of Bali, Java, and Sumatra during our previous adventure <laughs> serves as a striking reminder that we merely scratched the surface. It would take multiple lifetimes to fully explore the wealth of Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's big. It's big. It's big. Damn. Indonesia. Whoever shot this video did a fantastic job, man. It's like fucking cinematography in 4K. It's ridiculous. Okay, let's get a carry here. Let's go. There's something truly magical about witnessing the sunrise from a boat. But that's not all we're here for. A cute little boy. <laughs> that's insane, man. He looks tired. Oh, right here. Right here. Wow. Hello, we Can I tell you my secret dolphin call? Cooey. Cooey. <laughs> I feel like it's moments like these that remind us to do more with our time here. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Just, just wow. That's it. Just wow. <laughs> I'm here. It's a beautiful thing, man. Hey, George, what's, what's happening? Um, Bodhi needs to go pee. And when you gotta go, you gotta go, right? So, uh... <laughs> gotta go, you gotta go. <laughs> you know, few I know that. Never get old. And one of those is dolphins. Are you ready to get in? The dolphins are right over there. And we gotta be hanging off these ropes. This is an amazing video, man. Wow. That's crazy, man. My boys got undone. Dolphins, right in front of us. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, left. Ready, ready, go. And suddenly, we were in their world. <laughs> wow. It's magnificent, man. The beauty of it all. Who shot this video, man? She just looks so. I mean, this 
video looks so good. We have a slight obsession with vehicles that can go places, others cannot. It's like a safari car. Oh, uh, he's modding it, isn't he? Huh? Boogie, so we can go up in there. Which comes in real handy when exploring the new and old lava fields of an active volcano. That sucks, man. But it's, 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 uh, it's part of the life in Indonesia. They have volcanoes over there. I understand. Look at that smiling little boy face, man. He's been living the life with his dad, with his mom and his sister. That's what family's all about, man. Yasa is going to show us something with us. Oh. What do you think is underneath us? Lava. I think there's a big lava cave. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'd be so scared, though. You know what I mean? I don't know why, but I'd just be scared. I think I'd be scared because it's not the what I'm what I'm that what the norm is to me, you know what I mean? Because I'm not used to volcanoes. The fact that I hear a volcano and it could be underneath me, I'd be terrified. But if I'm with a tour guide, I'd be okay, you know what I mean? Unbelievable. It's yeah, it is. Endless fields. Before the lava here, before the eruption, Batu Pilet was here in this area. The special thing there is the lava is not coming in in that area, only that area. And the place which is now the big tree over there, mm. it was a temple. No. How is this possible? There is a wall of lava, almost as tall as these trees. That's incredible, man. That is incredible. You will feel the energy here. It's hard to fathom how a 30-foot wall of lava would stop and navigate around. It's not just that it stops there, but it goes on for another mile. Uh, wow. It just shows you the power of volcanoes, man. I've got the best portable pillows. <laughs> <laughs> You just found the coolest part of the rice terraces. <gasps> a caterpillar! Look! Wow! Are you nervous? No. Based on the number of buckles around you, maybe you should be nervous. <laughs> Don't get the, the girl terrified. <laughs> that's amazing, man. Have a slingshot. Monkey, the uh, one aggressive, just the things up. Not the um, stone. No. No, what just the wire. There? Just the noise. <laughs> oh, okay. There's nothing in there. Okay, so that's a that's humane right there. Lev, do not touch the monkeys, okay? I took the recycle when I'm a monkey. <laughs> you are a monkey. I'm a monkey. Yeah. What is going on? What is yeah. Mama doing? This little bite is on my face. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> that was a little scary. Okay, uh -huh. show your hands, everyone. Show Bodhi, your hands. show your hands. Bodhi, show Girls, say nothing in your hands. hands. <laughs> Is that like a monkey temple or? Mind you, I'm asking, I'm, already, I'm asking all these questions because I'm, I'm, I'm from the outside looking in. So I want to know. That monkey look, oh, gotta be. Terrifying. I mean, this monkey's everywhere. I had to put on my brave face, which I don't think I did very well, but I tried so that the kids didn't freak out. Watch out, you're going to step on one. Oh. There are monkeys everywhere. Hi, baby monkey. Oh, it's like you, little baby monkey. Oh, look how cute they are. Yeah, the teeth raise are sharp, though, man, because I'm sure if they get aggressive, it'll be a bad day. Baby, what is he giving you? A peanut. It's, it's a five -five finger. Have a 700 monkeys. 700 Damn. monkeys. 700, 700 monkeys. Three different families. Three different families. It's time for its mama. Okay, usually the only animal we feed is our dog, but we were enlightened that these monkeys depend on tourists and the guides for food due to their urban forest habitat. That's pretty cool. 
so they don't go out raiding the local villagers. Saw a guy just taught the kids how to call the monkeys, and they all started calling, and then hundreds of monkeys started appearing <laughs> out of the woods right at us, and here we are. They're like, what, what, what? I heard the peanut call. You got food for me? This isn't terrifying at all. You got food? <laughs> he doesn't want to get down. <laughs> He's like, I'm good here. This bumpy is tall. It's like a tree. <laughs> When I see those monkeys, it's like gazing into the reflection of our untamed kin. And you know what? Judging by how carefree their lives appear, maybe we made a mistake ditching the trees. No, oh, damn. And that was it. That's like a bold and profound statement. Look at how carefree their lives are. We made a mistake by ditching the trees. Did you really understand that? Like, we were all monkeys. A long, long, long time ago. We live free and we evolved in life. That's what he's getting at. And the way he, he watches them play around and have a good time in the trees. It's kind of sad that we, that's, we just the trees. That's what I'm getting at, what he said. Damn, that was, that was deep. Dead. The last one. That was so deep. That's it. Next morning, I snuck out by myself, mm. hoping to witness the Hindu sunrise ritual practiced by many across Bali. Little did I know that I would end up being welcomed and invited to share breakfast with one of the local families. These are moments that don't always make it on camera, but let this be said, the people of Indonesia are hands down some of the kindest and most welcoming souls we have encountered anywhere. I just left their home and they are. I'm still in, in shock and awe that this. They are, though. They are. Like I told you guys before, I've been on several cruises where the people that <coughs> the people that waited on us are Indonesian and they're so, so kind. So kind. It's amazing. It'd be a different story if I go to, when, I, when I go into Indonesia and I actually meet with them in person in their home territory and how they react. How they uh, treat me and stuff like that, but I'm sure it'd be the same thing as when I was on a ship. But they're so kind, man. You look at them, they, you look at, you look in their eyes. You see their souls. They're always happy. They're giving. They're caring. They're like, they're like the best people in the world. The best in the world. It would happen that someone would invite me like this into their home. I mean, it's such a Balinese and such a uh, non-Western thing to feel like people just like connection and sharing each other's time culture in culture a way, right <laughs> but yeah i'm absolutely inspired and over the moon it's incredible next up the land of volcanoes java java oh java lava <laughs> right i guess so to hit mount bromo Brody. do you know what we're doing this morning oh, the cute kid yeah. <laughs> I'm going over the <laughs> yeah. So many jeeps, here they come. And they all going to the volcano too. This is so crazy. This is insane. How how are volcanoes formed? It's a good question right there. Let me know. How are they formed? What are we going to do if the volcano erupts while we're up here? <laughs> Don't say that. You run it back down, get in your car, zoom away, call a police <laughs> to stop it and put a gate there. That's a solid emergency plan. Did you get that, Birdie? <laughs> no. Time to descend into the sea of sands. Usually a bad sign when everyone else is going that way and we're going this way. Uh, usually is a bad sign. <laughs> Damn, seeing that in person would be like a man, be like a dream come true. You could probably get goosebumps, chills. You'd be like, what the hell? This is actually real? Because you don't see stuff like this every day. If you see it in person, you'd be like, what the hell? Like, you look around like, 
Am I actually here? Is this real? Like, what? I know I would be like that. You know what I mean? Are you going to be driving? Yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Pretend like you're, you're holding on for dear life, Liv. That's amazing, man. Are you ready for this? That's the easy part, right, Pody? That's amazing. <laughs> what was I saying about this being the easy part? <laughs> She's tired. It's not so easy no more, is it? We lost count. Hey, Liv, do you hear that gurgling? That's the volcano. I'd be so scared. I'd be so goddamn scared. So scared. It's amazing though. How's that? It's really stinky. <laughs> Standing on the edge of an active volcano to hear and feel the Earth's immense power is nothing short of breathtaking. That's kind of scary. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure it's wider like, than I'm looking at the computer right now. It's probably like 10 feet wide, but still it looks kind of scary. Like, you know what I mean? Because imagine you fall in there. Oh man. Oh man. Hey, work smarter, not harder. Exactly. That is true. Smarter, not harder. Mm -hmm. But be careful though. volcanic eruption threw a wrench into our travel plans damn it's messed up the safety is key well we can just maybe just go through can we just go So nice. After making a couple of friends along the way, we eventually got there. You see her face? Just smiling. Having this. She could be, she could be having the worst day ever. But you can't tell because she's smiling. It's amazing. No way. Wow. That is amazing right there. It's like it's animated. It must be just like underground rivers or something like that. It's literally just spilling out of the side of the soil there. Do you want to get down there to the waterfall? Yeah! One of my favorite things about our travels is that we get to expose Liv and Bodhi to genuine adventures, allowing them to face challenges and experience the satisfaction that comes with real accomplishments. Yeah, it looks like everything is just held up by bamboo and some rope. Yeah. Um, I think I need <laughs> camera away because I need all hands. <laughs> all hands, all on, hands deck. on deck. All this right. is crazy. It's so slippery. Oh, oh my gosh, we found a monkey. I can't believe we just made that. After repelling down a waterfall, we assumed the worst was over, but turns out we were just, just getting beginning. started. <laughs> it's just now getting started. Zip it up, <laughs> I think the first challenge is going to be crossing this river. Mike, right, remember you did that when we were with the Ventuai. We cross rivers all day, every day. So we've got this, right? 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 <laughs> right? Hold on, little buddy. Experience, ex experiencing stuff like this with your family is like the best thing ever, man. <coughs> so much memories, man. You just built memories over the time. You know what I mean? That's why I say traveling is life. Traveling is life, man. You know what I mean? You just built memories. You can't take a take money to the grave. Only memories. Only memories. Oh, 
Amazing. 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 Wow. Just wow. Simply wow. Sadly, wow. it was time for us to wake up from this dreamlike adventure. And go home? I have a feeling that this is not the end, but merely the beginning. Man, that was insane, man. That was... <laughs> this video, I felt like I was there. I felt like I was living and seeing what they were seeing through their eyes, you know what I mean? But I'm not. I'm, I'm miles and miles and miles away. But anyways, guys, <laughs> hope you like this reaction. Hope you like this video. Go down below, smash the like. Comment, subscribe. Be part of the family. Love you guys. See you next time. Wow.